So what we have here is a two circuit, four vessel CIP. This is great for, you know, cellar operation cleaning, uh, food processing plants, uh, really anything that, you know, you're trying to save money on your cleaning process in your uh, facility. Good for, you know, big, large tanks. And we have several different versions, different sizes uh, that will meet any application that you guys could need. Uh, kind of give you just a quick look at some of the main components that make this skid uh, very user friendly and great for your facility. Uh, automated chemical feeding. So obviously chemicals are very big expense in a facility. Well, we have a, a monitoring system that will pump the exact amount required. So during your CIP process, we will dose the correct chemical usage uh, saving on those cleaning. This being two circuit actually allows an operator to clean two tanks at one time and it's fully automated. So the system actually knows what stage it's at and what, when it's going to move to that next stage. So instead of waiting on your operator to do the next step, the system's smart enough, it'll actually do it automatically, which saves on operation time and keeps those tanks in production use versus cleaning use, um, really saving, you know, capacity and not having to buy more tanks to meet production demand, you can save time by having a, an automated CIP. Uh, another nice feature, uh, four vessel. So having multiple chemical and recovery tanks means that we can reclaim water during the process and actually reuse it for rinse steps. Um, so then we're going to take that water usage down, which obviously is a big usage in a food processing or beer facility, um, which is great. All Siemens controls, very robust, reliable, and then we have the ability to remote in and provide updates and service uh, remotely so nobody has to show up and, and service your unit. Uh, look at, at the pump system here. So two pumps for the two stages, but we actually have two additional pumps that aren't shown presently here that we put in the field, and that's what actually returns the uh, fluids back to the process uh, during the cleaning cycle. So that way this skid can be located in one area, but your cellaring tanks can be further away and it allows the full closed loop system uh, to function properly. And those pumps are actually a, a liquid ring design, which is specifically designed for CIP. You know, there's other uh, versions out there from different people that don't necessarily use that and it makes it harder for the CIP to actually properly function uh, during that cleaning process. Um, some other really just nice things, you know, we use Endris Hauser flow meters, so we're getting the exact flow rate. And then on the back side, we use IFM temperature probes. So that lets us know during the cleaning steps that that set point temperature is being met. You know, it's a very critical step for say like an FDA regulated facility. Uh, they're gonna want that data and we're recording it in our PLC control uh, for future lookup and trending in use. Um, steam heated, so, you know, gonna send hot water uh, out to our tanks you know, we have the steam, so it's very fast, reactive, and it's gonna maintain those temperatures that are required during our procedures of cleaning. You know, thanks for watching. Uh, for any needs for your CIP cleaning skids, uh, give us a shout. You know, obviously these work great for brewery, distillery, uh, cold brew coffee, and any food processing facility. Thank you.